picture this life is a series of stops a series of frequent scheduled or at times unscheduled stops a series of stops from where we pick up and continue with our journeys the standard gauge railway which covers the Mombasa Nairobi route in 472 kilometers will have many stops or stations along the route the first phase of the standard gauge railway has two major stations seven intermediate stations and 23 passing stations Our stations are definitely beauty and brains. Not only are they beautifully and thoughtfully designed, they are also fit for their function. The Nairobi Railway Terminus and the Mombasa Railway Terminus are the two main stations at either end of Phase 1 of the SGR. The intermediate stations allow for passenger and cargo pickup and drop off while the passing stations allow for passing of passenger or freight trains in the same or opposite direction. Come, join us on a ride from the capital to the coast as we show you the marvel of the standard gauge railway stations. The Nairobi Terminus Station is a major station expected to handle multiple works and shall be composed of the following functional areas. Main Station and Passenger Terminal, Locomotive Maintenance Depot, Vehicle, Wagons and Coaches Maintenance Depot, Freight, Loose Cargo Area and Marshalling Yard. The main station building is designed to resemble two locomotives approaching each other from Malaba and Mombasa. On the way, the seven intermediate stations are to be found in the following locations. Athi River, Emali, Kibwezi, Mtitonde, Voi, Miasenyi and Mariakani. In the search for harmonious coexistence with the surroundings, the Athi River station's contour emulates the hills near the station. In Kibwezi, you have to feel at home under the trees with a station inspired by Kenyan traditional buildings and roofing materials. When you see the Mtituande station, you want to picture the mountains, clouds and trees. The V-shape for Voy Station represents its hometown and is inspired by Harambe, the spirit of unity and pulling together. It is also thought of as a form of homage to our founding fathers. The striped Miaseni Station resembles the zebra and African ceremonial body paint and shall serve as a tourist stopover. The Mariakani station was designed to reflect the distinctive coconut trees with tall style porticos and cornices and sun louvers. The Mombasa railway terminus is a major station conceptualized to resemble waves and ripples in the water radiating from the central tower with platforms and track line representing the shore. It is composed of the following functional areas. Main station and passenger terminal, freight and loose cargo area, and power substation. Aside from the passenger and freight stations, there shall be 22 passing or signal stations and one port station, the Port Roots Freight Station. The Inland Container Depot in Embakasi is considered a station in its own right. It was established to realize maximum benefits of containerization of cargo through the transshipment of cargo and is being expanded to increase capacity. It will have a capacity of 450,000 20-foot equivalent units, TEUs per annum, 
and includes facilities for storage and consolidation of goods, maintenance of road or rail cargo carriers, and customs clearance services. These stations are arguably the crowning jewels of the standard gauge railway's entire operations. They are magnificent architectural works which also cater to an assorted array of passengers' travel needs and help facilitate the train's operations. Mm-hmm.